problem based on that loss and gain of the time this concept of p already told already discussed in intro, intro of the clock time gap between two consecutive position and this also i told p is greater than 65 into 5 by 11 then clocks will going slow losing time this this is all now if clock is gaining the time just suppose then what will happen this you don't confuse keep in mind actual time whatever has shown in clock it will be less than shown in clock clock it is showing 5 hours 18 minute it is gaining the time actual time will be maybe 5 hours 14 minutes 5 or 15 minutes actual time will be always less than shown in clock if clock is losing the time then actual time always will be more than shown in clock whatever clock it is on just suppose 5 hours 30 minutes it is slow actual time may be 5 hours 32 minutes 5 hours 33 minutes then if clock is losing actual time will be more than shown in clock if clock is gaining the time actual time will be less than shown in clock now based on that just we'll go through few example questions example 6 the minute hand overtakes the hour hand after every 67 minutes what is that p value 67 it is more than 65 into 5 by 11 yes it is more means clear cut we can say this watch or this clock is losing the time or going slow how much going slow that only we have to calculate but one thing is sure if value is given more than 65 into 5 by 11 it will lose the time if it is less than that it will gain the time 67 minus 65 minus into 5 by 11 it will be 17 by 11 minute per hour in a day just to multiply 24 hours 60 by 67 why we are doing like this 60 this is we have converted in minute nothing else 24 into 60 divided by 67 we will get 33 minutes into 159 by 737 minutes we are losing in one day now just suppose if this day when you have seen the clock it was monday the next monday how much time difference will come if you are looking the same clock if no rectification has done based on that question can be and we will discuss in uh, uh, another session which is related to clock that is analysis of question there we will discuss uh, almost 20 questions in one one session how many degrees minute hand move in the same time in which our hand move by 8 degree a simple calculation our hand is half degree per minute 8 degree 16 minutes minute hand 6 degree per minute 16 minute 96 degree means our hand if take, taking 8 minutes 8 degree during the same time minute hand will move by 96 degree